It all started with a small potato patch in 1996 for Angela and her Dutch father. It was an idea my dad had. I, he asked me to help him out and I reluctantly helped him out. I was a U of A business degree and a poli sci, so absolutely no intention of getting into agriculture. But I fell in love very quickly with potatoes and with food. Just outside of Edmonton was where the first test was planted. 18 years ago, it was washed in a bathtub. We harvested everything by hand. So yeah, a far cry from that now. It was started all small, like all, they all do. One of their first moments of success was catching the eye of the head chef of the Banff Springs Hotel. From there, they would go on to purchase their first plant for their little potatoes. These are called creamers. So what are creamers exactly? They are little potatoes, um, technically 19 millimeters to 41, but they are thin skinned, very creamy in texture and taste, and really easy to cook with. Today their website is full of recipes and ideas for these mighty tasty little guys. So we're going to make a uh, potato fondue using some Gouda cheese. Grown substantially, we grow now about 5,500 acres across Canada and the U.S. You can find most of our potatoes in every retailer in Canada. They have even stepped up the production and selling process by lobbying the government to change the packaging to a smaller size, making the product more convenient for consumers to store and use. Just one of the reasons she's being honored in the community. It's humbling, um, but you spend most of your time your head down and don't even realize what you're doing. So uh, it's nice to be recognized and acknowledged. Um, but there are so many strong businesswomen in this city that, you know, I'm just a representative of it. The Little Potato Company is definitely no small potatoes as they continue to improve the local agriculture community and the health of the less fortunate by donating over 25,000 pounds of potatoes to the local food bank every single year. And they also aid local farmers with their call line. So the little potatoes that are maybe not going to make it out, they get brought out of the plant and they get given away to pig farmers to use as feed. It's just one of the ways that this great little company is giving back to our community. Just as the company has come far from the original potato patch, so has the CEO's personal development. For me, I think the biggest lesson as I got older was all about recognizing balance, that you don't always have all your buckets full in your life and it doesn't happen all in one day and sometimes never in a year, but over time it happens. And not to ever get discouraged by that fact. With strong values and a complete desire to remain the creamer of the crop, the Little Potato Company is proud to still remain all in the family and made in Edmonton. From the factory, I'm Bianca Jane.